Hey guys, it's Brendan Borman back for another 270 video. Tonight I'll be playing as Julius Caesar taking on Robert Kennedy, a candidate you do not see very often. Julius Caesar, I'm going to open up in national groups. I am going to get my big conservative, which is 20%, and then my gun lobby, which is 40%. Robert Kennedy does have a vice president, which does boost his labor and environment, his women's movement, and his town and gown. And so, knowing that he did not go national groups on that turn, I'm going to go ahead and get my big conservative, and I'm going to throw my other 50 into Massachusetts. My goal is to either force a clash or force an overspend. So, we did predict right. Kennedy is going after town and gown. And so on turn number three, what I'm going to do is going to go ahead and get my gun lobby. And instead of trying to make a play for Massachusetts, I'm going to hope that Kennedy does overspend. So not only are we going to get a cash bonus from this point forward, but any cash that he spends, which was three additional pips, that is more money that is in our favor. So it is two to one bonuses. We do have 517.5 thousand dollars let's take a look at caesar here uh, we could do all kinds of things but i think i want to pressure new york so i'm gonna try to go after high tech which is a neutral bonus caesar does not have a penalty or a bonus and so california with pennsylvania maryland and virginia will give me that bonus and he already has a foothold into arizona in Maryland and Virginia, of course, are both African-American states, so we could delay um, Kennedy from doing that. I'm also going to open up in Arizona. Hopefully, he does spend his town and gown money there and does not hoard it. And so if we do get the, the uh, high-tech bonus, we can put pressure on New York. Okay, turn five. It looks like that we are not facing any pressure. We did not go up in California. We are this turn, and I did open up in Michigan just to have an extra outlet in case I needed it. What I'm going to do is just have enough money is to possibly do the hangman strategy. If I keep all these states, I could have uh, manufacturing without Texas. It might put the screws on Robert Kennedy, make him choose what he wants to do next, go for a swing, go for African-American, or something else. Okay, so turn six is over. We're winning 181 to 105. There is the high-tech bonus. And so what I can do now is move up in a couple states. I will not be able to get the bonus this turn. However, what I could do is pressure in North Carolina, pressure in all these swing states. So I think I'm going to take away all of the manufacturing money that's not swing, and I will go from there. Of course, Kennedy does have Arizona, Iowa, and New Hampshire working towards swing, and he is going up in Colorado and in Ohio. So he is making a play for the swing state bonus. We did clash. That's $50,000 more in clash equity that's in our favor. And so my initial thought is to maybe throw all 190000 of my high-tech money into New Hampshire, but I really want to pressure New York. And so what I'm going to do is put one in New York, one in Florida, and then go four, four pips, just one passed in New Hampshire, which probably will be in, unsuccessful. He has been using his town and gown money to defend, and I'm not quite in Iowa yet, which I will get in Iowa on this turn. Okay, defense in North Carolina, and he does lock out New Hampshire, and there's a big spin in Ohio. So while he does get the swing state bonus, he is going to have a hard time defending both Florida and New York. My prediction is he leaves Florida alone and defends New York. But I'm going to zero turn spend and just see exactly what he does. He goes two in New York. 
in one in Florida. And now we have 202,000 of high tech money and 1.6 million. This is the power of national groups. I could double tap Texas here and get so many bonuses. However, I'm gonna zero turn spin one more time. And, okay, now he cannot close off New York because he has 100,000 of swing. And so I can go ahead and steal it from him. Uncontested, all that money is gonna be gone. I might try to steal North Carolina. It may not matter. He might quit the game after this move. But I do have 360000 to play with. I could open up in Texas. There's the New York steal. And there's the forfeit. Good game, Tyler. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will catch you guys in the next 270 video.